good to train for Rusty. Rusty is a little diesel engine who works on the narrow gauge railway. He often checks that tracks, tunnels and bridges are all in good working order. One day Rusty brought some trucks to Ellswood station. Duncan watched him pulling in. Humph! said Duncan. Those are the same trucks you've been bringing in for the past two weeks. I can't help it, snapped Rusty. These trucks are very old and dirty. And just like you, interrupted Duncan, and smelly. And I don't want to take any advice from you, not like the time when you told me how to stay on the rails and then you went off leaving me to fire my own coaches. Correction, said Rusty. You were the one who went off to fetch your own coaches and then look what happened. You rocked and you rolled along that line and then came off the rails. Well, that's maybe so, said Duncan. But you're still a dirty, old, smelly and most annoying diesel I ever met on this railway. Rusty felt hurt. Later, Rusty was on his way back to the quarry, but he was thinking what Duncan said to him. Maybe I am a dirty old smelly diesel, he thought to himself. That's why I keep pulling these old trucks. After he'd finished shunting his old trucks at the quarry, he went to Wayside Village Station. He didn't feel useful anymore. Thomas was bringing him some new trucks. Wow, said Duncan. Are those trucks for me? No, replied Thomas. They're Rusty's new trucks because his trucks are getting too old. You haven't seen him, haven't you? Because he was meant to be here to collect them. No, replied Duncan. Meanwhile, Rusty was still sadly resting at Wayside Village Station. Just then, Dennis arrived. What's the matter, Rusty? he asked. Well, Duncan says I'm an old, smelly and dirty diesel, and he finds me annoying too, Rusty replied. And I'm always pulling the same old trucks, and they do make me very old and dirty, but I don't really feel like a useful engine. Dennis smiled. You're not that old, you may be dirty sometimes, but you're far from annoying, and the most important thing of all, you are useful. Diesel's engines can do useful things. I learnt that from Thomas, because when I first came here, I wasn't really useful, I was being lazy, but he soon got me to change from lazy to useful. I suppose you're right, Dennis, said Rusty, but I would like to hear that from a steam engine. You will, said Dennis, you'll see, and then Dennis set off. Back at Eldwood Station, Rusty's truck still hadn't been collected. When Thomas stopped by to collect his passengers, he saw that Rusty's trucks were still there. Why hasn't Rusty collected his new trucks? He asked Duncan. I don't know, replied Duncan. I haven't seen him since this morning. Just then Dennis arrived. Have you seen Rusty? Asked Thomas. Yes, I have, replied Dennis. He's at Wayside Village Station feeling upset, and Dennis told Thomas what Rusty had said to him. Duncan, said Thomas, is this true? Yes, it is, said Duncan. That wasn't very kind of what you said to him, said Thomas. Diesels can do useful things, like the time when he saved you from the old wooden bridge. Duncan felt very ashamed. I think you should go and say sorry to him, suggested Thomas. Rusty was still resting at Wayside Village Station when Duncan arrived. Rusty, said Duncan, I'm sorry of what I said to you. Rusty smiled. That's all right, he said to Duncan. You are the most usefulest diesel I, I have ever known on this railway. And there's a new train of trucks waiting for you at Eldwood Station. Really? asked Rusty. Yes, replied Duncan. These trucks you often pull are getting too old for you. Soon Rusty collected his new trucks and he felt better. He was very pleased with his new train and he felt like a really useful engine again.